With many of Minnesota's legislative races in the Northland remaining in current party control, there might be a major flip on the Iron Range. KBGR 6's Kendall Jarbo explains why one race could be headed for a recount. Kendall. In the Minnesota State House, District 6A seat covers the Hibbing and Chisholm areas. A Republican is close to claiming that longtime DFL held seat by just 47 votes. Rob Farnsworth is leading by a slim margin with 100% of the precincts reporting, but the race hasn't officially been called yet. Farnsworth challenged incumbent representative Julie Sandstead. She's held the 6A seat for two terms. Two years ago, Sandstead beat her Republican opponent with more than 60% of the vote. State law says an automatic recount for a state legislative race happens when the difference in votes is less than one half of 1%, which it is in this case. Sandstead says she expected the race to be close, but not this close. Votes will continue to be counted until next Tuesday before the possible recount happens. In the meantime, she's encouraging people to stay confident and trust the process. As we move forward in the counting, you know, my, my, my vision is to still be on my district and to continue to serve my constituency and to continue pushing forward for the work that we still need to get done. Sansed says she has faith in the electoral process and believes the decision will work itself out. She believes big issues on people's mind this election are the coronavirus and economic relief for families and small businesses. Farnsworth didn't want to do an interview until the race is finalized, but said he is confident his lead will hold.